there are just so many good good reasons to eat vegetables and fruits. You're low on energy, eat fruit and vegetables. Feeling tired, sluggish, bloated, eat vegetables and fruit. I promise, I'm, I'm not, I'm not bull, I'm not BSing. I got some salad on my beard. Your skin ain't looking good. You eat, you drinking too many sodas. Cut that sugar shit out. Look at that. Look at that. Look how smooth that skin is. And I don't, I don't even exfoliate and all that. You know what I'm saying? It's just natural. But it's also, as you already know, as you heard the saying, you are what you eat. So what you put in your body, it's a reflection on how you look. Real talk. If you don't drink enough water, did you know that your skin starts to like, it's real dry, like your lips is dry and your your, your skin starts to, to shrivel up. I was like, what? Yeah, all that, that's, that's water. So water, fruits and vegetables, man, you do that, you good. You start cutting off like some stuff, like as I told you, like gummy bears and all that other shit is not all, it's not part of the food group. If you want to get the results that you want, you have to do some things that are uncomfortable. Put the chips down, pick the salad up, all right? I go through these bags of fruit, of these bags of apples rather. Like I eat two of these a day. They're like, dang dad, you eat a lot of fruit. Yeah, I'm supposed to. When it comes natural to me, it's easy. Oranges and all of that stuff instead of, you know, that bullshit. How much does it cost to go to the dentist now? A whole lot, right? How much does it cost if you go to the hospital, you know what I'm saying, if, if you have something? And if you watch like when people talk about cancer and how they beat it, I watched I, I watched somebody today on YouTube. They said they beat cancer by eating vegetables and and uh and and fruit. Fruit and vegetables. I said they beat it. This is the pomegranate, the most powerful fruit on the planet. And here's why. For one, it has anti-cancer properties. Studies have shown where it helps fight prostate cancer breast cancer, and even colon cancer. It also helps to reduce arthritis and joint pain. It also helps to lower blood pressure. So if someone who has high blood pressure, this is your best friend. No meat, no chicken, fish, no none of that shit. None of that processed, because you don't know where the hell them cows be. You don't know what they feeding them. You don't know what they injecting into. You have no idea. You have no idea what's going into your chicken. Have you ever seen how chickens live? How they, how they like process chickens? I bet you haven't. But listen, so all I'm saying is, you want to feel better, you want to look better, try, you, you really need to change your diet up. That's all I'm saying. Okay, I'm going. Peace. What's good, people? Uh, I'm about to make this quick salad right quick. I ain't going to do a whole bunch of talking. I'm going to go ahead and put the tripod on her and get to it. Let's get it. All right, so... Pretty basic, right? I have my salad. That, you know, you can get any salad. I like the romaine because it has the carrots in them and the purple uh, cabbage, which I love. So I'm gonna put that in the bowl. I don't know how much. It's nine o'clock. I think that's that's a good amount, right? Nice handful. Yeah, it's not it's not brand new lettuce, guys. So don't trip. Uh, but a lettuce is lettuce. You know what I mean? So. I don't care about that brown stuff. You'll be all right. You eat ass anyway. Right, so that's good. I have my, my eggs right here. I'm going to cut those. But I wanted to cut the cucumber first. First I wanted. I actually don't mind the skin, right? But, I mean, since we have the peeler, that's what I'm going to do. Not a whole lot. Just take a little bit off. That's it ain't going to bother me. All right. That's about all we need right there, right? Push this to the side. Okay, I'm gonna cut these little edges off the ends. Not, not, not Nothing's wrong with the ends, I just go and cut them off. They still got the little green stuff on there. All right, then we just slice them. There ought to be no particular way. Nice cut, you can cut them thick if you like them. I like the taste mine. So I say about medium, that's pretty good. Uh, I like to put the roasted garlic on mine. Yes, I do season my salad. Okay, just nothing crazy. I put a little bit in the salad, just a little bit. I like garlic anyway. If you have actual garlic, that's probably gonna be the best for you, but I use what I do. I do a little bit of season on, guys, just a little bit. Wow. All right, I'm gonna put that in there. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Okay. 
So I have the uh, red onions. These are uh, a little different than the white ones, but they have a different flavor. I'm just gonna cut those. Not a whole, whole lot, just a little bit. Dice them. Most people don't like raw onions, but these aren't too bad, they're pretty good. Throw them in there. All right. All right, next I have, what do I have next? I have some Deli Farm turkey breast, right? I, I, I've only seen like sh shaved chicken a couple of times, but okay. I like turkey. I'm mm, gonna cut that up a little bit. My mama actually is the one that got me into salads. I used to eat them when I was small. She used to make them, and um, I used to dog them. Though. She was like, well, I just asked you if you want a salad. I was like, yeah, but yours looked amazing. And ever since then, I have been loving salads. I put a little bit of everything in there. All right, so that's the turkey. Let's go ahead and put our eggs in there. I'm going to put about two, even though I'm going to eat all these. Okay. Some people take the yolk out. I don't mind the yolk, you know what I'm saying? But let me go eat this. Oh, yeah. That's good, good. Okay, take, take your egg, right? You know, you can do is slice it. So just, just like that. Nothing complicated about it. Real easy, easy simple. There yeah, it is. Do the same thing to this one. I'm going to leave the yolk in. Like, like, I guess cubes, but I said I like it. It works. All right, we're almost done, guys. We're almost done. All right, so I, I wasn't sure if it looked weird, me just talking the whole time, or did you want to see my face? You want to see all this. All right, so this right here, I'm not sure what these are called. Like, I mean, they're called croutons, but it's called toppings. Salad toppings. It sounds weird. Oh, yeah, it says salad topper on there. So what I have right here, so this is new. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do these first. So I have the cheese garlic crouton from... Food line. Um, they have about. How do you feel? I have a little crunch in my salad. Um, there's a whole bunch of salad toppings. You can really go crazy with them. They have a little bit of everything. The second one is going to be tortilla strips. It's not really my jam, but it's not too bad. I think people feel like they don't like salads because they think it's boring. No, you can do whatever you want to do with your salad. Mm -hmm. There you go. On top of the other, the other egg on them. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I uh, turned the camera around because I was like, I wanted to record this salad, but I didn't want to record me. Like, is that weird? But anyway, so the egg, the other eggs in, is in there. That's egg number two. We got two eggs. It's looking really good. I just check out that big bowl. I like to mix mine. And then uh, we got a couple more things when we're done. So this right here is, is the, the salad topper, but this has, it's, it's a protein pack, right? Let me read you the ingredients. I can't even say that first one. Edamame, edamame, damame. I don't know. Cranberries, cashews, sunflower seeds. But look at it. I'm gonna look healthy, bro. It look healthy. Now I've had sunflower seed before. I've had cranberries. I've never had them in my salad though. But look at it. It look good, right? Yeah, it's gonna pour that in there. Yeah, look good. Oh yeah. I can actually eat this all by itself. I don't really need it on the salad. This is good. This is good for just snacks, period. Oh yeah. We're almost done. Of course, you can't forget the bacon. If you feel froggy, and you wanna and you wanna make your own, fry it, and chop it up. That ain't bad either, okay? But for today, that's right. Baking it up. All right. Last but not least, we have Olive Garden Ranch. Olive Garden Ranch, very good. Find us at Walmart or Food Line. This is very good. I wish I can show this thing. Come on, y'all want to see this? Come on, man. Look at that. Look at that. They're probably saying, shoot, you don't need no dressing. Yeah, that's that's nice right there. Y'all want that. Come on, man. Y'all want that. You oh, it's dirty. You can see all my all my ingredients, all my trash. I'll I'll put it up once I'm done. There it is. Let's get into it. Okay. I don't like drowning my salad in salad dressing. 
I like to taste the salad, okay? So I don't put a whole, whole lot of salad dressing. But I mean, what I just put in there was pretty good. If you need to add a little bit, that's fine. But like, I don't think you should drizzle it. Let me see. So this has 150 calories, which is not bad at all. I'm sure you, sure you eat a lot more than that. Uh, a quarter of a cup is 140 calories. So like, once you add all this stuff up, like, it's, um, I don't know. I don't count calories. I'm a, I'm a grown up, I'm a grown ass man. I don't really count calories. I eat what I want to eat. And then I go to the gym and work it off or walk it off or whatever. All right. All right, let's dig in. Let's stir it up. I can stir it up. Nice and meaty. Let's see what we got. Oh, hell yeah. Hmm. I almost forgot something. Mm-hmm. Gotta put those panos in there. Yeah. Yeah. You see it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I didn't add cheese. This was a quick salad. Mm. Jalapenos hit. Mm. The crouton go. Okay. So good. That's it. I'm full. I ain't gonna pop my mouth full, but. You can taste everything. Like right now, cranberry, taste the egg. Obviously the salad. Taste everything. The only thing I don't think is, is a turkey. Probably not a bite. But the croutons, we have everything. It's just like good. Mm, turkey. Mm. Yeah. That's it. A really good blend. All right. All right. So I didn't finish that big ass bowl, but here I want you guys to understand. Those of you that aren't comfortable with, with salads, you don't really like them. Eating green is part of the food group. All right. It's just important for your body. If you look at some of the stuff that we eat, potato chips, gummy bears, and all that crazy shit, if you look on the five food groups, like, you, you, like you're not gonna see any of those. It isn't even real food, all right? Salads are on there. Your fruits and your vegetables are number one source of protein, energy, all that stuff you need, it comes from fruits or vitamins. Vitamin D, I mean, fruits or vegetables. So you got vitamin A, vitamin B, vitamin, all, that, all, all those vitamins, all those good nutrients come from your 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 salads, your vegetables. I like vegetables, I like greens. This is my jam. So I try to make it interesting as much as I can. If you're eating a boring salad, you're you're getting just salad and putting a little salad dressing on there, well, no wonder you have to force yourself to eat it, okay? Make it fun, make it energetic, and I guarantee that you would make more salads and you enjoy eating them. Last but not least, I right, thank you guys for watching. I just ate that salad, right? And I got full but I'm gonna eat the rest of it later. The thing is, when you get full off salad, it, um, it, it, it's not the same fulfillment as like meat or eating a burger. <laughs> Excuse me. You ever like ate too much and you just feel like you can't move or do anything, you feel sick? Salads don't do that, okay? I said salads are straight nutrients, straight. I said, don't you know, you, you don't need to put anything crazy in there. You know, put your chicken, put your fried chicken if you want to. You can put your, your salmon in there, salmon. You can do so many things with salad to make it, you know, spruce it up. I do more salads. I found some cool new things to try that I never tried before. And I'm, you know, I'm, I'm really excited about that. So, you know, I get it in. If you don't like a certain thing, I mean, don't put them in there. But the things that you do like, go for it. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Definitely comment down below. Let me know what you think. I want to know what you put in your salad. Peace.
I'm really glad that my spot is still here. This is a little spot that I found. I'm not sure when it was. If I ain't mistaken, it was the same time that I had to go to court for a, a visitation or whatever. And I um, I came across this spot and I just really liked it. That was really awesome. Look at all the little boats and everything like that. You see the one right there. Um, it's just really peaceful. So I, I think this is gonna be my like my chill place. Um, there's some more places over here. I'm gonna show you some more. But it's just really mellow, really mellow. You come here and breathe it. It smells great. You can get that stress out, bro. Because support. Back to the video. Like I said, it's a nice little trail. Something you can do with the family. I'm pretty sure I have my kids out here. Just vibe. I know I already said bye. But um, this also is a nice spot, nice and easy, breezy. I don't know a lot of spots right now. I said I'm new to VA. I'm gonna start work soon. I'm gonna have Kobe here. So I, I, I won't get to do a lot, lot. But trust me, I'll make it happen. I like to explore. I like to find new things. I like food, so oh, that's nice. I think it's a whole little trail. So yeah, I find it, find more things to explore. Just chill, man. Ugh, nice little bench. Come in and just explore. Come in and just chill. Take a breather from the regular day to day and all the stresses of life. And just chill. Get your thoughts together. Try to figure out what your next move gonna be. How you gonna do it, you know what I'm saying? All right, y'all, I'm gonna roll. I still have to go to back to the place. I gotta do some job stuff today. I was at the VA all day today. I didn't get nothing accomplished. I had to, oh, that sucked. That, that was annoying. It just, it just, you know, I, sometimes I feel like it's always something. You, know, you, you gotta jump through hoops to get shit that you need, and that's, that's annoying, but. It's, it's all good. I'll, I'll get it. Um, but I said I need it for work. Uh, just a little, a little so-and-so. But I'll get it done. Let's go.